When you're doing MSK questions on the USMLE, if they give you a normal x-ray, you should have tendinitis on your differential. If they give you uh, erythematous joint with an elevated white blood cell count, you should be thinking maybe a septic joint. If they give you other symptoms elsewhere in the patient's body, then you're thinking something like an autoimmune disorder. If they give you a visible fracture, obviously it's going to be some kind of an orthopedic injury. If they give you a palsy, look for the wrist drop, the nerve infractions and other places that you can get neurologic type symptoms. And if you have common nerves injured, something like the radial nerve, look for arterial injuries also. So remember the mnemonic D-barn, D-B-A-R-N. So the deep brachial artery runs along the radial nerve. So if you have a radial nerve palsy, also look for a deep brachial artery injury, especially if the patient does not have a pulse in their wrist. So if they don't have a radial pulse or they have an expanding hematoma, look for a deep brachial artery injury, possibly also a brachial artery injury.